Sonia and Sasha, for real. You're listening to Brimbank Live and Live. If you this is a Sonia and Sasha for Real show, you know it's our favourite day. You know that we always bring on the best guests ever, Sash. You know oh, that we do that. And, and we didn't even need to stalk this time no. because he's our friend. Well, he, it's, 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 it's stalking from the previous past. It's like, you know, um, it's like <laughs> ghosts from, from Christmas past, that sort of stuff. This is old stalking rehashed and brought back to us. <laughs> No, this is not just this. Um, this is an incredible friend of ours that we found back in our old days in a previous life that we had when we had the Australian Teenage Expo. Yes. And along the way, we just met these incredible people, and um, and then we met Krishul, who is like he oozes peace and love, and he's almost like I just think of him as like my soul friend. You know what I mean? Like he just oh. he brings me joy to my heart. I love listening to his stuff. I love his music. We've been able to work with him for such a long time and we've just developed this incredible relationship with him. He's from The Voice of 2014. Can we give a massive round of applause for our beautiful soul friend, Krishul? Thank you so much, ladies. That is one of the warmest introductions I've ever had. Can, can I take you girls out like on tour? You can be my MC. Like, yes. I love the way you introduce me. That That is like, thank you so much. Yes, yes, Kushul, yes, yes. Don't ask me twice because I'll go to <laughs> Werribee with you right now. I'm so desperate. Do you know what I mean? Like, if you've got a gig in Hopper's Crossing, I'm coming. Do you know what I mean? She'll carry Andy her. Nong. I'm even going down the road. Like, get me out. So if you, if you need an MC, I'm not saying no. Sasha rocks up with a gaffer tape and a suitcase. Away we go. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I love it. Krishul, you burst into our lives uh, on the screen for most people uh, on The Voice 2014. I remember Red Leather Jacket, Usher, oh, my God, the dance moves. We fell in love with you. You had the dreadlocks. You had the whole pizzazz, the smile that lit up our lives. You worked with Will I Am. That must have been incredible. Tell us about that really quickly before we get into your new single, which we're so loving. Thank you. Yeah, that was that was one crazy experience. You know, I, you grow up watching these artists on TV, Ricky Martin, Will I Am, Kylie Minogue, and then you're on stage, you're performing to them, and Will I Am turned around. That was that was the highlight. You know, um, I mean, to this day, it's one of the, the highlights of my life. And um, I think as an artist, being able to uh, receive. Uh, recognition you know encouragement from people that you admire that's um that's a whole other level i mean it's it's fantastic being able to perform in front of the stage but also to, to be coached by someone that you look up to and the entire experience like i'll take that i'll i'll, I'll take that with me you know everywhere i go is oh. his mind just as amazing as we think it is absolutely i mean look uh it's, there are so many positive things to say about Will I Am, so I don't know where to start, but yeah. he's one of these guys that is always trying to keep people on the level. Like he's always thinking about how to, how to sell you. Like there, there are times when, um, you know, I, I remember watching the show and uh, there are artists that didn't necessarily get on the show, but he, he's always looking for a way to promote them, trying to plug their social media. He's always trying to make you feel calm and relaxed and he's always cracking jokes, you know, he's, I mean, it's, he's the, He's the perfect uh, mentor because he's always thinking about not only your music and how to promote you, but thinking about your mental state, trying to keep everything, everyone together. So, uh, I mean, the entire experience, you know, throughout The Voice, like, I didn't even feel as if it was a competition, you know, I just felt as if I was um, just having a party, you know, courtesy of Will I Am. Oh, how good is that? What an incredible experience. How old were you when that happened? I was... Hmm. Well, I would be disclosing my age. I'm about, I think I was about, <laughs> it's about 19. No. Well, well, you know what, we're no, 23 just... and a half, so it must be around about the same time as that. <laughs> no, I, w I was, um, yeah, I was. I, so, hang on. I was older. He was, yeah. He was, yeah, yeah, that, and we'll go with that because, you know, Sonia yeah, and I haven't gone past 23 and a half. 23 and a half every birthday, same birthday. Every yeah, time. so because we haven't dealt with our age yet. So you, you're quite welcome to bring those issues to the table right here. <laughs> now, you've brought out lots of singles that I've loved and, you know, they're all stored on my phone and they're part of my playlist. But this song that you're about to release, it's today or tomorrow that you're releasing it, let me in. Where did this come from? Because, honestly, it's your best work. I absolutely love it. If you can probably can hear, I think my kids are about to kill each other in the background. I'm really <laughs> sorry about that. Um, tell us about Let Me In. Thank you. Yeah. So um, I wrote this song about a year ago 
And it's about, it's about when you first start seeing someone, they have these walls, um, they don't want to open up to you. And it's about breaking those barriers and trying to get someone to, uh, yeah, to open up their hearts so you can allow the magic to happen. So the song is really kind of about, it kind of expresses just going for it, you know, and kind of just not, not have any reservations and um, just allowing that magic to, uh, to happen by opening. I'm a firm believer in the idea that when you open up to someone, it gives them permission to open up as well. And uh, okay. that song was kind of like expressing um, that, that feeling of, um, yeah, opening yourself up to someone so they'll finally kind of let you in. So the song's called Let Me In, and it's really just going for it, no games, just pure sincerity. I think um, sincerity is the, uh, is, is the gateway to, to love, you know? Like it's about being real, and that's what the song is about. Do you see? Do you see? I see. You should pre preach just louder for the people in the back, for sure. That's what we need to say. Uh, um, I, hang on. Can I ask you this personal question? Sure. Did that come from experience? Like, did you have to reach deep into the soul, and, and did that come from somewhere? Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> no, it's it's definitely from experience. I think we we all start off, you know, guys and girls. I mean, um, you get hurt at some point, and you you build these barriers, and uh, you don't want to open yourself up to someone because you don't you don't want to feel rejected you know and uh, at some point you realize that when you do that you're not able to experience the magic because the, the magic is what happens when you're you're actually open and you let people into your life so i feel like um obviously at the moment everyone's going through a lot of social isolation you know and i think it's probably the worst time to be single right now and uh, i think people are having to open themselves up granted they they can't well, a few weeks ago, they couldn't go over to their parents' house or their friend's house and uh, spend time with them, but they're having to reach out and connect to people and bear their souls. And the more you do that, the, the less isolated you feel, because it's so important right now, I think, to have connection. And the only way you do that is, um, the only way you let people in is by um, by opening up and getting past all of that, all the all the fears that you have, you know, all the barriers. I think vulnerability is what it's about. So, um yeah, it's definitely something that came about from personal experience. Oh, 100% vulnerability is the absolute key for all of that. Um, I uh, I can't stress that enough and I, I try to be as vulnerable as possible, especially on social media because I think that we're always all closed up and we're all trying to portray that, you know, our life is all perfect and the fact that you're doing that. I absolutely love following your little morning walks. Um, I love your morning walks where you just It's been a while since I've done that actually. Yeah. I love I've loved, you know, during COVID you'll go for a walk and you'll talk about anything that comes off the top of your head and that's been incredible. I've loved following you. And so everybody needs to get on social media and follow you because you're absolutely raw and you're honest and you're real and your music just actually oozes that stuff as well as well. So thank you. Well, thank you very much. Well, you know, I I do like to call myself the uh the chocolate Nubian soul brother, uh, emphasis on the word soul. And it's all about all about being real, you know? I think soul music, uh, music in general, is, is an honest expression of what you're feeling. And uh, I, I like to purvey, I like to call myself a purveyor of vibes, you know? And it's not just musical vibes, but it's, um, it's, it's truth bombs, it's life bombs, you know? So I, I, often, I often do these videos, these rants. I have a podcast, um, I've had, <laughs> had G. Sasha on the, on the yes! podcast. And uh, yeah, I, one of the things I love about you is similarly, and even more so, you're very soulful. You're very open about everything that you're feeling. And, uh, you know, I, I obviously went through a rough year. A lot of people went through a lot rough year and uh, you opened yourself up to me. And you definitely, um, you definitely, I think you've given me permission to even be more soulful than I am as the chocolate newbie and soul brother. So uh, I want to say thank you for that. Oh, <laughs> thank you. I just... People just need to follow you because you've you've done really good. And get onto this song. Let me in. It's amazing. I'm going to be spreading it out there because it is a really, really good song. Thank you. Speaking of vibes, this song is a whole vibe. We're going to listen to it right now. It hasn't even been released yet. So this is, I think, an Australian world global first. Let's say that. World world first on the Sonia and Sasha for Real show. Thank you, for sure. We adore you. We hope it sells millions and millions. Let me in featuring Kristen. 
Um, so have a look at social media for both artists. Please follow Kushal. Please thank you, Kushal, for being on our show. We love it. Listen right now to Let Me In. You're listening to Sweet. And if I can just plug it, be sure to check out Kristen. That's on Instagram. Kushal, K-R-I-S-H-O-O-L on Instagram. You know what it is. Beautiful. Amazing. Thank you, Chocolate Nubian King. We'll see you soon. <laughs> <laughs> you're listening to thank you so much, Sonia. Thank you so much. Bye, we appreciate the opportunity. This is the Sonia and Sasha for Real Show. Let me in. Coming up now. We'll be back soon. Turn the lights down low. Let your world unfold. Try to lose yourself and go with the flow. Let your mind be free. Yes, your soul is see. I can be your Messiah. My heart stops. I'm made. On your strings played, how you move my world, make me wanna sing. You could be the cure, what I've been searching for. Let's set this world on fire. Can't keep this feeling inside of me. I don't even know who I'm meant to be. Feel like I reach nirvana. I can't take the spell I'm under. If you let me in, if you let me in I'll take away your breath of fire, you won't believe You're my sun, my moon, you are my everything If you just give me a chance, then I'll make you see Let's not waste our time, come over at nine Let's sit back on wine, let me pour some wine Wait in several weeks, now you are Souls up, king. This ain't a flame. You could be the cure. What I've been searching for. Let's set this world on fire. Can't keep this feeling inside of me. I don't even know who I'm meant to be. Feel like I reach nirvana. I can't shake the spell I'm under. If you let me. If you let me in, I'll take away your breath of fire, you won't believe You're my sun, my moon, you are my everything If you just give me a chance, then I'll make you see Can't keep this feeling inside of me I don't even know who I'm meant to be Feel like I'm rich, no, I'm I can't shake the spell I'm under If you let me in, if you let me in I'll take away your breath of fire, you won't believe You're my sun, my moon, you are my everything If you just give me a chance, then I'll make you see If you let me in, if you let me in I'll take away your breath of fire, you won't believe You're my sun, my moon Sonia and Sasha, for real.